everyone, it's Pat from Pat to Have Music. Put away your guitars, today we're gonna to have a little bit of a chat. Now, we're gonna be talking about why you're not practicing. Okay, I can already feel people's curses are flying around and they're like, X out. Uh, I don't want him to know I'm not practicing. I feel guilty already. Okay, let's just stop right there. So we've all been there, myself included. We've all just think, ah, uh, I don't have time. I've got a family, I've got two families. I've got three families, my old family, my grandparents, they live with me, and I've got a cat, and I've got a dog, and my parents have cats and dogs, and my kids have cats and dogs, and you know, I've got a business, and you know, I have three different jobs of my own, and a paper route, and then, you know, my kids' homework, and um, uh, you know, all this different stuff. There's always excuses not to do something. But at the end of the day, if you're one of those people, and you've been playing for a little while, and you're wondering to yourself, huh, I've been playing for a few years, I'm here. Maybe I've gotten a little bit up to here, but really, I should be here if I've been playing for X amount of years, right? This is for you. This video is gonna help you. So, what you need to do is really stop and, and think to yourself, okay, in five years, in 10 years, at the end of my lifetime, where do I wanna be with the instrument? Is it just something that I just wanna do for fun, once a month, once a year, meet old band mates, or is it something that you really want to dive into, something you want to excel at. Do you want to write your own music? Do you want to record your own music? Do you want to be on stage? Or do you just want to be better at playing the instrument? If you answered yes to any of those questions, really, you just need to practice. That's all that there is to it. If you do have problems with your fingers, with your back, something that's wrong with, you know, with your muscles or anything like that that's actually stopping you from playing, then that's different Then you need to go see a doctor. But if it's purely just practice, then you know what to do. Well, all you need to do is either go to Google, sign up for a Google account, all free, get a Google calendar, just like what I've done, or get a physical calendar or write it. If you don't want to waste that time and you just have a piece of paper and a pen, write up a calendar, write up a schedule, okay? What you need to do, and this helps me so much, is just get up half an hour earlier. That's all you have to do. So if you see from my crazy schedule that I get up, I exercise, and then I practice guitar. So before the day even starts, before I have the shower, uh, before I go to work, that's what I do. I come home from work, see family, see friends, see girlfriend, you know, uh, write some music, uh, record, make videos, all of that stuff. But at the very start of the day, that's when the practice is done. So at the end of the day, I know, okay, I'm going to bed. Hey, I've done well. I've practiced, I've exercised, I've eaten healthily, I've seen the people that I love, all of that stuff, right? So I think that'll really, really help. And yes, it may be a struggle, you, um, getting up half an hour earlier, 20 minutes earlier, an hour, whatever you want to put in. But it's so much worth it to the fact that every week, every month, every year, you'll actually see progress and you'll be like, yeah, I said to myself, no, I'm going to go to bed a little bit earlier and I'm going to put some time into something that I care about. If it's every day, amazing. If it's every second day, that's still good. If it's every third day, that's still really good. It means that you're not sort of chunking in one or two hours, you know, or three hours here on the weekend and you're just noodling around. It means you're actually investing time every day or every second day to getting better. And that's what really, really will help. It's what it will help you playing like that every day or every second day. It will really help you remember what to play, remember the muscle memory, remember what songs you're playing, everything like that. You'll excel so much faster if you can just get up that little bit earlier. Now, if there's people out there that say, oh, you know, Pat, I don't have time. I can't get up earlier. You know, rubbish. So when I'm studying, I'm studying at the moment full time, masters. So what that means is that means that here, this is what a normal day looks like. It doesn't matter if it's, you know, Monday, doesn't matter if it's Sunday, every day is the same because if I'm not at work, I'm at uni nine to five. So it's every day is the same. So if I can still find time to practice with all of that going on, you can too, definitely. I've heard all the excuses, but really at the end of the day, you only get there if you want to get there. And if you're not finding time, it means you don't want to get there, really. Sorry to be brutal, but I really want this year to be the year that you say to yourself, you know what, no, I'm sick of staying at this level. I want to get better. You guys can do it. If you want free advice, if you need help with anything, send me a message down below through my Facebook, Pat David Music. It's all for free. I do actually like and care for you guys and I wanna help you, I wanna see you succeed. Now, if you're wondering, well, you know, I've been playing for ages, I don't know what to learn, head over to here. There's a grade one playlist, over a hundred lessons there and all for free. Otherwise, check out this other video, but send me a message if you're having trouble. Don't wait for tomorrow, start tonight. As soon as this video ends, go practice. Tell me what you're struggling with below if you feel confident. Otherwise, just tell me what else is going on. Either way, leave a comment below. I've been Pat from Bad Dead Music. See you all again, bye.